my name is Ben Gerwing. Uh, I'm 26 years old, so I'm pretty young, but I've been here for uh, 11 or 12 years now, and I'm the Vice President of Alberta Boot Company. My grandfather started the company in 1978. He originally flew Spitfires in World War II, did various other businesses. Uh, he hired my dad shortly after that, uh, who was the president and GM for 30 years. He retired about two years ago, and then uh, I kind of learned the business through him and then took it over from him about two years ago. I kept thinking somebody should be making a good boot in Canada. And, uh, after a couple of years, it uh, fell on uh, me. <laughs> and nobody else is going to do it, I guess, except us. And it was something that I'd kind of grown up with, so I was really used to coming down here when I was a kid, uh, you know, learning all about how we make boots, how to sell boots, and what everything that goes into it. Everything that we make in the back, we sell in the front here. So 99% of what's going out the door is something that we make ourselves. So one of the things is it takes you know three to four weeks per pair of boots to go through. So it's a it's a long process. There's over 200 steps. As long as we keep the quality up, there's no reason why it shouldn't carry on. Calgary, you know, as big as we become in oil and gas and, you know, finance or whatever it may be, there's always the people that want to be wearing their Calgary boots. Yeah, we've done a, a lot of people from movies to singers, things like that, so uh, Paul Brandt's a good customer of ours, he's got a couple pairs. We do a lot of movies as well, so Brad Pitt with Legends of the Fall, we did the Brokeback Mountain boots. And most recently, of course, last year we had the Royals uh, come to Canada as part of their tour, so we were very happy to uh, outfit both of them in a pair of boots. Unfortunately, we didn't get them into our store, but uh, we did uh, get boots on their feet, so we were very happy with that. <laughs> it was quite exciting and uh, rewarding. A lot of hard work, but uh, being an entrepreneur, I guess you just uh, for, forget about all the downs and concentrate on the ups. Ideally, a uh, son or daughter of mine would uh, would step up in the future. I mean, that's still <laughs> years away, of course. Uh, but I mean, I'd love to see it go into a fourth generation. That'd be, you know, the number one thing that I'd like to see. 